Hello, I am Flash Isaac. This is Flash Lenas. You are now watching More Than 20 Days to Jam, a series containing more than 20 episodes which covers all the topics in Jam syllabus. Each episode comprises detailed class, questions, and homework. The questions and homework are from the Flash Lenas Jam application. This makes the app a requirement for this class. Visit Google Play Store or flashlearners.com to get the app. Do you have trust issues? Reach me on any of my social handles for activation guide or inquiries. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to take off. This is episode number 19 of the 120 Days to Jam Mathematics with Flash Isaac. In this episode, we shall be rounding up indices, logarithm, and sorts. We've been looking at this topic since episode 15. We continued with episode 16. Episode 17, we did the same. Episode 18, we did the same. In this episode, we shall be solving questions using the Flash Learners Jam application. In this episode, I shall assume that you understood all we've done so far, meaning I shall be solving questions very, very fast. Nevertheless, if you have problems, reach me in any of my social handles. Make S the subject of the formula. We are given 7 is equals 2 to the power of S minus 1 plus 3. And make S the subject of the formula. This is change of subject formula equation leading to indices. From here, if we collect like terms, we shall have 7 minus 3 is equals 2 to the power of s minus 1. 7 minus 3 is 4. So 4 is equals 2 to the power of s minus 1. In indices, we try to make the base the same so that we can equate the power. Make the base the same so that operations can be easy for us. If we do that, this becomes 2 to the power of 2 is equals 2 to the power of s minus 1. Because 4 is the same thing as 2 raised to the power of 2. Now the bases are the same. It therefore means that the power can be equated. So this is 2 is equals s minus 1. Since 2 is equals 2, the 2 at the top is equals s minus 1. From here, 2 plus 1 is equals s. 3 is equals s. And s is equals 3. Option A is the correct option. And here it says, if log 2 with base 10 is equals 0 0.3010 and log 7 with base 10 is equals 0 0.8451, evaluate log 280 with base 10. This is the task before us. We solved questions like this before. Uh, that was where yeah, we said the log was it 4 times 7 to give us a particular number? No, log 16 times 7 to give us a particular number. So in this case, we are given log 2 and log 7. How do we get 2 and 7 from 280? Either directly or in a simplified form. Ladies and gentlemen, what is 4 times 17? 4 times 17 is 280. If you agree with me, it simply means this is the same thing as log 4 times 17 with base 10. In log the indices and sorts, there is no fixed way of solving. Based on how the question comes, you just look for a way to simplify from the laws, from experience, and from reasoning, experience especially. Now that you've seen that previous question, and you've seen this question, if you see questions like this, you always know what to do. Your reasoning will go there. This is why you must follow the episode, get the Flatliner Jam app, activate, and solve similar questions. So with that, there is no question that will surprise you in Jam. Now, look at this. From the law of logarithm, if you have this, log to base a times b log to base a times b this is the same thing as 
log to the base plus log to the base of the second number. From here, this is the same thing as log 2 raised to the power of 2 with base 10. You can see that we've been able to bring out log 2 with base 10. Plus, here, we cannot bring out 7 directly. We cannot say 7 raised to the power of something to give us 70. However, we know that log 10 to be 70 is the same thing as log 10 to 7 times 10. So log 10, 7 times 10 is the same thing as log 10 to be 7. So this is this multiplication law. If this is this, and from the law of logarithm, if you have log base m raised to the power of k, you bring down the power. Bringing down this power, we have 2 log 10 base 2 plus re reapplying the law. This is the same thing as log bm plus log bn. So here is the same thing as log 7 to base 10 plus log 10 to the base 10. With this, food is ready. Why did I say that food is ready? Because log 10 to base 10 is 1. Any log to the base, if the base and the numbers are the same, then you get 1 as the answer. And we have log 2 with base 10 already given. We have log 7 with base 10 given. We simply substitute to have 2 times log 2 to base 10. They said 0 0.3010 plus log 7 to base 10, they said 0 0.8451. Then plus log 10 with base 10 is 1. So if you do this operation, you should be able to arrive at 2.4471. 2 log 9 with base 3 times log 81 raised to the power of minus 2 with base 3 over log 6 to 5 with base 5. It looks complex, but it's something you can solve easily. Log 9 with base 3 times log 81 raised to the power of minus 2 base 3 over log 6 to 5 base 5. From here, we know that if we are able to make the number here and the base the same, life can get very, very easy for us. What do I mean by that? This is the same thing as 2 log 3. 9 is 3 raised to the power of 2. We've not changed anything. And this is the same thing as log 3. Before then, from here, if you have log to base to another number raised to a power, or you have log raised to any power, we can bring down the power to give you minus 2 log 3, 8, 1 over 5 raised to the power of 4 is 6 to 5. So log 5, 5 raised to the power of 4. Look at a hint. If you have a base and a base and a base, bring your calculator. The base begins to point. Like here is 3. Say 3 times 3 equals. If it doesn't give you what is here, cancel. Enter 3 times 3 times 3. So see if you multiply 2, 3, 4, 5 times, whether you get what is here. If you get it, fine. Like in this case, there is 5 here. We know that we are trying to make bring out 5 out of here and power on your calculator point 5 times 5 25 no cancel press again 5 times 5 times 5 that is 3 times see what you get cancel press again 5 times 5 times 5 times 5 so if you try like if you keep trying and it's approaching the number here you know that once you try 4 times you get 6 to 5 therefore 6 to 5 is 5 raised to the power of 4 that is the trick so this is here now there is power here we also bring out bring down the power as the law 
So to give us 2 times 2, this becomes 4 log 3, which is 3 times 81 is 3 raised to the power of 4. There is 3 here. Just say 3 times 3 times 3. You get 81. So here is 3 raised to the power of 4. Okay. Log 3. 3 raised to the power of 4. Over. Here. Bring down the power. So 4 log 5. Which is 5. From here. When you bring out the power here. You have minus 2 times 4. 2 times 4 is 8. So this is minus 8. Food is ready. If the log and the base are the same, that will give you 1. So log 3 to base 3 or with base 3 is 1. Log 3 with base 3 is 1. Log 5 with base 5 is 1. So 4 times 1 minus 8 times 1, 4 times 1. So give you 4 times minus 8 over 4. That will give you minus 8. Option D is the correct option. So ladies and gentlemen, this brings us to the end of this episode. For your assignment, get the Flaxinus Jam app, go to Mathematics, choose indices, logarithm, and sorts. Solve the questions that follow. Let me know if you have further questions. See you in the next episode.